Imagine waking up one morning and finding out that only 5 out of 100 of your closest relatives are still around. Heartbreaking, isn't it? This is the grim reality Malayan tigers have faced since the 1950s. As recent as 70 years ago, there were an estimated 3,000 Malayan tigers throughout the peninsula. Today, only 150 or 5% remain due to loss of habitat and poaching. In 2009, the government rolled out the National Tiger Conservation Action Plan to protect the animal that is central to Malaysia's identity. More recently, Prime Minister Anwar Ibrahim took it a notch higher by announcing stronger measures to protect the critically endangered species. The measures, which include the expansion of protected areas and increased enforcement, are part of the 12th Malaysian Plan midterm review. Christopher Wong from WWF Malaysia says the initiative will provide a boost to the survival of the Malayan tiger. What's even more encouraging is the government's commitment to cracking down on wildlife crimes, expanding protected areas, and getting local communities involved. This approach doesn't just benefit the Malayan tigers, but also other endangered animals that share the same home as the Malayan tiger. Wong, who leads WWF's tiger conservation program, also lauded Putrajaya's move to encourage small businesses to adopt eco-friendly practices. It is indicative of a well-rounded approach to conservation, showing that they understand the importance of both nature and economic growth. Pertubuhan Pelindung Kazana Alam President Damien Tanem Divian wants the Wildlife and National Parks Department, or Perhilitan, to be further empowered. So since Perhilitan is a federal uh, agency under NRECC, the state is not obligated to listen to them in land-related matters. The government has to empower Jabatan Perhilitan Malaysia, which is the Wildlife and Game Department, to have powers to object when areas which are critical to tigers and all other protected species in Malaysia are eyed for development. With the government's renewed commitment, hope burns bright for the survival of the Malayan tiger. Danish Rajareza, FMT News.